I'm all done wrapping Dad's anniversary present for you. Oh, is it someone's anniversary soon? <laughs> oh, you. Just kidding. Oh, I wonder what it is. It's a... Oh, shucks, I can't tell you. But, but it's really nifty. Well, it looks like we're going to have to do something extra special for Mommy and Daddy's anniversary this year. How about on Saturday we all go have dinner at Bennigan's? Bennigan's? Oh, boy, you mean it? Whoopee, at Bennigan's. I'm going to get the ranch and baby back ribs. Calm down there, cowboy. You've still got four days. Four days? Oh, I don't know how I'm going to wait that long. Who's the boy that can laugh in a storm cloud, turn a frown into a smile for free? Who's the kid with a heart full of magic? Everyone knows it's Butter. That's me. Who's the boy with eyes full of wonder who thinks being yourself is the best thing to be? Who's that rascal with the tweezers in his pocket? Everyone knows it's Butter. That's me. Jumping in puddles, skipping down the hallway. Head goes to the petting zoo. He loves John Alway. Who's no that tyke with the cutest little dimples? Batting his eyes at every puppy he sees. If you look inside yourself, you might be surprised when you find a little boy. Three more days till we eat at Bennigan's. That's 72 hours. Oh, gee whiz. Well, if you two will excuse me, I need to go out and buy a certain special lady her anniversary present. I hope he means me. <laughs> Don't be silly, Mom. Of course he means you. I'll be back in a little bit. Butters, you're in charge of the house. Yes, sir. Oh, I wonder what he's going to get me this year. We won't know till we're at Bennigan's. Every year it's the same. Your father gets me some great gift, and my gift to him falls short. I've just got to outdo him this year. I've just got to. Dad's a good shopper, all right. Butters, maybe you could secretly follow your dad and see what he's getting me. You mean spy on him? Uh, but ain't that kind of like Bebbin? No, it's a little different. You remember when the nice policeman gave you a badge and made you an honorary inspector? Sure I do. Why, I think Inspector Butters could find out what Daddy's getting Mommy without him ever knowing. What do you say? Inspector Butters is on the case, ma'am. Everyone knows it's Butters. Well, that's me. Dad's going to see a movie. How nice. White Swallow Bathhouse. Everyone knows it's Butters. Well, that's me. And that sure had a nice night out. Well, did you see what he got me for our anniversary? Well, first, he went to see a movie. A movie? Huh. I wonder why he'd want to see a movie by himself. I don't know, but it wasn't at the movie theater at the mall. No, it was that really old theater downtown, that stud cat. I didn't even know it was open. Wait a minute. What was the movie called? Fishing Fire Men 9. I never seen one through eight. Oh, my God. But it must have been a real short movie, though, because Dad came out like ten minutes later. It must have been a sad film, too, because he had a bunch of tissue paper with him when he came out. Poor old Dad. Movie really got to him. Butters, where did Daddy go after the movie? To the gym. To the gym. Yeah, the White Swallow Spa. Ah! Yep, he went there and he wrestled with all kinds of guys. He wasn't too good, though. This one black guy had him pinned down for 15 minutes straight. Butters, are you sure about this? You have to be absolutely sure. Inspector Butters gets all the facts. I even got some neat old pictures. The only thing I can't figure out is why Dad told you he was going shopping for your present when he was going out seeing movies and wrestling. Did you have a nice trip, Mom? See you next fall. <laughs> so, Mom? Butters! Well, that's me! Paint must paint. Paint must paint. Everything clean. Paint! Wow, honey, you've painted the entire house. Three times. Must paint. Everything clean. Everything new. Say, Butters, I'm having real trouble finding an anniversary present for Mom. Any ideas? Hmm, I can't think of one. Well, then, it looks like I'm going to have to go out shopping again. <laughs> Paint. Everything clean. Everything new. Paint. <laughs> I'll be back in a little while. Should I go try and see what he gets you again, Mom? I don't think Daddy's shopping. I think Daddy's going out wrestling again. Paint. Paint. Must be made clean. New. Hey, a new paintbrush. That's what Dad could get Mom for their anniversary. I gotta go tell him. Must clean butters. Clean. Never be clean. Must kill. The only 
way? Must kill butters. Paint. But let me. One, please. Like a two thirteen. Thanks. That works. Why is that fall thing not quite high enough? Uh, Mr. Garrison? Who is that? Dad! Dad! Are you wrestling in here? Dad? This room's taken. Well, uh, pardon me, sirs. Dad? No? Hmm. Ah! Butters! Hi, Dad! Oh, God! Oh! Oh. I'm glad I found you. I think I know the perfect anniversary present for Mom. What are you doing with your wiener out there, Dad? Butters, you'd need to leave here right now. You need to get out of here. Go home and wait for me to talk to you. Oh, well, all right then. We'll see you at home. Oh, Jesus, no. Oh, what have I done? It's finally here. It took you long enough? The moment you've been waiting for. Uh, hey, Dad. Come here, son. I want to have a talk with you. Well, sure thing, Dad. Son. I want to talk to you about lying. Oh, I know lying's bad, Dad. You told me so. Yes, it sure can be. But there are also times when distorting the truth a little is appropriate. These are called little white lies. Little white lies? See, sometimes telling a little white lie is okay. Like, for instance, when you catch your father jacking off in a gay man's bathhouse. Uh, who's Jack? Butters, the point is that I think that if you told Mommy what Daddy was doing tonight, well... She might go completely insane. Oh, no, that won't happen, Dad. It won't? All right, good. No, because I already told Mom, and she's fine. You what? Butters, Mommy wants to take you for a little drive now. A drive? Oh, boy, I, I love a good drive. Is Dad coming, too? No, sweetie, Daddy needs to sit and think. All right, see you in a bit, Dad. Oh, boy, a drive. Well, geez, you wouldn't have believed how angry I was when the teacher said I had to share my finger paints because I've been sharing them all along. Butters, you know that Mommy loves you an awful lot, don't you? Well, sure I do, Mom. I love you, too. And sometimes mommies do things that seem hurtful to their babies, but it's really for the best. Oh, you mean like the time you washed my mouth out with soap for saying nutsack in front of Grandma? Yeah, I need to behave myself. If a mommy has to end her life, she can't let her baby alone in the world to be raised by a sick pervert. Well, sure, that makes sense, I suppose, yeah. Hey, did you see my manners anywhere? It's cold out here. I'm going to get out of the car now, Butters. I want you to stay put with your seatbelt fastened. Oh, well, 